Good morning, I am now awake. Let's talk in the kitchen. Oh, nope. Okay, we need to keep them out. <gasps> Bang! Come on now. He tries to eat everything. Absolutely everything. It doesn't matter what it is. As long as it's food, he will eat it. Sometimes, even if it's not food. For breakfast, I'm having a slice of carrot cake. By now, the recipe for this carrot cake should be up on my channel. It's so so good, you have to try it. This is actually my second carrot cake and I eat like several slices every day and I'm sure once I finish this, I'm gonna make another carrot cake. It's just kind of like my addiction right now. So yeah, hi, I realized I haven't really given you an introduction. Today I thought I would go ahead and film a little bit of a day in my life. I'm mostly just home today and I was like, if I don't film anything, I'm just not gonna do anything. But because you're here, you're basically watching to make sure that I do stuff. Today Yasu was actually supposed to be working and like he left for work in the morning, like super early. And then he came back and he was like, yeah, they said it was at seven, but they didn't mention which seven. So it turns out his work is at seven o'clock at night tonight. So he is at home, but he got up really early. So now he's just like in bed. To be fair, I think I fucked his sleeping schedule up because he used to sleep like a normal person. And my sleeping schedule's always been terrible. It's just like a constant, constant struggle in my life. Even as a kid, I could never, well, could, I don't know. Like, cause I as a kid could never fall asleep at night, but could any child fall asleep at night? I feel like that's a universal experience. Maybe I'm wrong. But yeah, there's just never been a time in my life where sleep has come easy for me. So today I did wake up quite late. Here is our little late breakfast. But hey, it doesn't mean that we shouldn't just continue with our day. I can't eat anything with the cats in the room at this point. Well, Lala's fine, but Teddy, the new kitten, he is a menace when it comes to food. He will try to eat absolutely anything. Even if I have like a pasta and it's got something dangerous like garlic and onion in it, which pretty much every single thing I cook has in it, he will still try to eat it. So basically at this point, the only thing we can really do is just kick him out when we cook and when we eat. So that's what we do. Oh yeah, because this day in my life is also to get you nice and acquainted with Teddy. Because I haven't made a video being like, oh, Teddy's here. I mean, I did say it in one video, but like I figured at this point, the kitchen content needs to slow down. <laughs> Like my channel can't just be like kitten video after kitten video after kitten video. So this is the day of my life But also we do have a new kitten, which is like a part of my life. I don't know. I guess this is another kitten video <laughs> The cake is so good. Oh, I didn't even say what I was gonna do today. I don't know why but lately I feel like my ADHD has been getting worse. You might see it in the baking video I don't know. It's just been like a thing in my life right now. What are we talking about? Oh, yeah my manager. I have two pairs of jeans that I would like to adjust. I honestly need to get more into sewing. I have like a sewing machine and everything. And you know, I have like a lock machine. I have like everything that I need to sew. The issue is when I sew, I make a huge mess and that mess stays there for a good while because I will sew and sew and sew until I'm so tired that I literally pass out until like 5 a.m. or something. And at that point, I literally just do pass out and go to sleep. And then I wake up and I'm like, nah, I don't wanna do the mess. And like, I don't know. For me, I'm the kind of person who like, I have to keep my apartment clean. So I hoover every day, I'm gonna hoover later today as well. Like I have to keep it up, otherwise the moment it starts to get messy, that's it. That's it for like three months. So yeah, today's chores and adjusting some jeans. I've never sewn denim before. I don't really wear denim. You guys already know I don't wear jeans. I have two pairs of jeans. One that I recently thrifted that I think you guys are gonna love. I love it so, so much. And that's why I was like, okay, because I have another pair of jeans, right? And I don't love them. I just kind of have them for when I want to wear jeans. So despite the waist being too big, I never bothered adjusting them because I was like, mm, whatever, you know? But now I have these jeans and they're like nice and I like them. So I'm like, okay, I really actually want to adjust these. So I've never adjusted jeans before. I got a needle especially for it and I lifted up and I don't know, it looks easy enough. <sighs> See, I'm mostly today I thought that I was gonna be home alone. So I don't really know how the rest is gonna go. Maybe I still can help with my chores. I'm gonna finish my cake. Oh, and then I'm gonna shower. Normally I shower at night, but yesterday I had a friend and she left at like nine o'clock at night and by the time she left, I was so knackered because I cooked like three meals. So I didn't shower last night, so I'm gonna shower today. I'm gonna get ready a little bit just so I feel like a decent member of society. Yeah, that's where we'll start. We'll start with getting ready. Look who's sleeping. Oh, little teddy bear. He'll sleep anywhere. Lala, on the other hand, has her favorite sleeping spot. And Yasu is just playing his, oh. <laughs> Yasu is just playing his games. He doesn't have work until later, so he's just chilling. This man, 
this man needs a haircut. God. So upsetting. Oops, sorry, I think I just poked you in the eye. Oh my god, you guys, look at him. He's so cute. Oh, <laughs> little mlim. And we're back. So for some reason, I kind of dressed like a school teacher. I'll show you the look. Looks like I am about to give you homework. Yeah, I literally just threw something together, so this is what we're wearing. It's just that I spend so much time at home these days that if I don't sometimes just put on some makeup, put on an outfit, I just stop feeling like I belong in society. Like I feel like some kind of hermit who just lives detached from everyone else and never goes outside, which is pretty much what I am, but I'm kind of still in denial about it. Um, I'm kind of hungry, so I have some hummus in the fridge. It's not good. It's like salty. Like I got it and it's like the one that comes in a can. I know hummus is like really easy to make, but it's so much effort to take the skin off the chickpeas, so I can't be bothered. So it would be so nice if I had like a nice hummus that I can get in Japan. But no, I've tried the one from Gilmo and stuff. Everyone's always recommending that one. That one sucks, I'm sorry you guys. But I already opened the can, so I think I need to finish it. I made some flatbread with it yesterday, so we still have some of that. It was so easy. Literally just Google like flatbread recipe. It's so easy. You literally, you put together the ingredients and you fry it on the frying pan and it's done. So easy. We have to put all the bread on top of the fridge. Otherwise the cat will eat it. Oh, and we still have lemonade. That I made yesterday. I feel like the cat is starting to wake up because he can hear me prepare my meal. The bread's a bit hardened. Maybe I should microwave it. I don't know, I'm really lazy these days. The hummus is better than I remembered at least. Yeah, I know you want to eat it, but you can't. You can't. You can't. Oh no, are we doing this? Okay, I gotta kick you out. Can you guys tell me, are you supposed to put pickles and olives and stuff like that in the fridge? I don't know if you're supposed to, but I always do it because I'm scared. Fuck, why is that so hard to open? Okay, I need to get us to do this. Huh? <laughs> huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was, it was really hard. Oh, baby. <laughs> what a feast for me indeed. Sorry guys, this is like such a casual day in life video. I need to literally just my life. I just realized I left the straighteners on. My straighteners do this thing where if you leave them on for long enough, they start beeping at you, which is like really helpful because for some reason I always forget to turn them off. I think they also turn it to the lowest temperature so you don't burn the house down. I feel like that's a really important feature for straighteners that I own. It is such a miracle that I've so far not burnt one house down. Okay, I actually think now is a good time to adjust those jeans that I was telling you about earlier, mostly because I just ate, and I feel like jeans, like even if they fit really nicely before you eat, after you eat, you've like gone up two sizes. And because they are such a strong material, what do I call it, non-stretchy material, I really just don't want to like adjust it and then it becomes too late for me after I've had dinner, do you know what I mean? Like there's no point. So now's a good time, because I just ate, and now I have some chores to do, but I think I'll just do them later. Because I feel like doing the jeans now. Okay, we're gonna do that. Okay, so I just tried opening the door, and... You won't let me. Why are you standing there, you little goof? Hi. Welcome back inside, my friend. He's a very licky boy, but then sometimes he starts biting. What are you licking off me? I just wash my hands. He's so cute. Do you know how hard it is for me to say no to this face every single day? What? What is it, little whiny? What is it? What is it? He has the whiniest meow in the world. It's like, <coughs> there's no food, so it's fine. There's no food. That's just lemonade. He's not gonna drink the lemonade, is he? Is he? He's like, <laughs> he just licked the... <laughs> what is the food? I'm scared now. No, it's not. Oh, look who's feeling affectionate. Is it you? Are you feeling affectionate? He's such an angel. He's being so sweet for the camera, which is weird because he's usually quite the troublemaker. You are, you're a troublemaker. You coming up? Oops, you coming up? The sun always comes in this side and it's so tempting to take a nap. Look how tempting it looks to take a nap in this bed. Look who's followed us here. Are you gonna help us with the jeans? You are? 
they're so friendly. You're so nice. Okay, here's the first pair of jeans that I'm doing. It's literally just a really simple pair of jeans. Jeans? Jeans. And they never really impressed me, so I never bothered doing them before. But more than anything, I want to do them as practice. So we'll do this pair first. And then here we've got this beautiful pair of jeans that I thrifted. And they are a bit big around the waistband. And I heard that one way of doing it is just to turn them inside out and then just kind of pinch the sides. Oh no, you cannot be chewing on that baby. No. 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 <laughs> He's such an angel. He's so pretty in the sunlight. No! This is turning out already a lot more difficult than I thought it would because it's really difficult to put on a pair of jeans that's inside out. It's not like an insane, oops, amount that needs to be taken off, just like this much. What do you think, little baby? This is my best friend. I feel like jeans are never high-waisted enough for me. I feel like I need jeans that come up like here. But yeah, this much would be a good amount. I need assistance. I'm gonna ask Yasu to help. Okay, great, we've picked up what we wanna make smaller. Let's go and sew. Here you can see the little office room where I keep my sewing stuff and also where I keep like a lot of things that I need to get rid of, like clothes that I want to get rid of. This is basically like a fancy storage room slash sewing room slash the litter box is also here. So it's like a cat room as well. Yeah, this room needs a lot of work, but there is my beloved Chuki. So. Let's get started. To begin with, I have to fix this situation. This is not something that's going to be useful when I'm sewing. So, using chalk, I'm going to just kind of draw the line. Now I'm going to use actual pins and place them in a way that's actually useful when you're sewing. These pins are not great for denim. There's probably like better pins out there that I could have gotten, but I didn't. This is a bit difficult. Also, I think he's trying to eat the needle. <laughs> Do I have any pink chalk? I think I used to. Do I still? No. Because this white chalk is actually very difficult to see in the denim. Are you trying to go off to some wild adventure, my little friend? We can't have you go outside because you will try to eat everything. I might just start by sewing this side. There's some children playing downstairs. And Teddy is thoroughly entertained. Teddy's had his fun with this machine. Most sane people would not let their insane cats have free reign on their expensive sewing machines. But I do not have space. I'm just going to go ahead and change the needle real quick. Great, the needle has been changed. Let's change the thread. I decided to just go with a blue thread. It's on the inside anyway, so I don't think it'll make that much of a difference. <sighs> Whoa! You have taken an interest. No, why are you trying to lick the thread? What's wrong with you? Do I have to kick you out? Babe! Oh, I have to spin the bobbin. Fuck, I forgot the bobbins were a thing. That's how long it's been since I was last sewing. All right, we're in business, it's coming through. <sighs> Setting up for sewing takes so long. Okay, I'm scared. I don't have any denim to test this on. And this needle isn't good for cotton. Should I just try with a piece of cotton anyway? Just to check that everything's okay. It's sewing fine, so I don't know. Let's just give it a go. I'm so nervous. I've never sewn denim before. How is this gonna go? How has this gone? And it looks, I mean, it's bad, but it's not like the worst. I probably should have checked that it was matching up to begin with. I don't know why I didn't think of that. It's been a while, you guys. Okay, we've now sewn both sides, so let's just go and try them on, see how this turned out, fingers crossed. Okay, so that does actually fit me a lot better. The only thing is, it's quite sudden, like the size changes really suddenly. They fit a lot better than they did before, and it's not the worst job in the world. So let's do the other pair. He's just laying there cuddling my jeans, you guys. I think it smells like me. Oh, he's so sweet. Hi, so for some reason this is going terribly, which is weird because the last pair of jeans I feel were thicker and they went fine. So I think I'm gonna take a little bit of a break. I actually feel like the neighborhood cat might be outside. There's this cat that lives in the neighborhood. She's so sweet and she's always got her little tongue sticking out. I love her so, so much. I've named her Maple. She's an old lady and her teeth seem to be not so great so she can't eat dry food so we feed her like a soupy kind of 
thing. So I thought I'll just go out and see if she's there. This here. Oops. Sorry, Lala, baby. Oh, I haven't seen you all day, have I? No, I'm not feeding you guys. I'm feeding Maple. No, I'm not feeding you. Oh, look who it is. How did I know you were here? Hi, little Maple. Are you going to show them your funny little tongue? Oh, what a lovely lady. Hi. Hi. Oh. Aren't you the friendliest little thing? Look at her tongue, you guys. It's so cute. She's just an old little lady, aren't you? And I definitely think she needs some vet help, so... I'm kind of broke this month because, you know, Lala was ill last month and that was super expensive. But I think next month, I've already asked my vet, I think I'm going to take her to the vet and just kind of get her everything that needs done. I think she definitely needs dental help, don't you, baby? Okay, let's feed you. Are you hungry, Angel? There it is, Angel. I'm not sure if she's actually hungry. Oh, she's so cute. Maybe she's not hungry. Maybe she just wanted attention. Did you just want attention, little Maple? Oh, honey. We're gonna get you fixed up real soon. Let me know if you want to watch that, you guys. I might film her little journey because I really love her. We can't keep more than two cats in our apartment, so I don't know what I'm going to do about that. If anyone wants to adopt a beautiful little old lady, I will pay for everything to get her fixed up. So please, contact. Well, I guess she wasn't hungry. Okay. Well, I'll leave the food out for you, okay? And then you can just eat when you're hungry. I just really feel like maybe she was someone's pet at some point. Look at her silly little tongue, it's so cute. She's such a darling, but she definitely needs a bit of a bath, don't you, Maple? I really want someone to adopt her. Okay, we're off now. I'll see you again tomorrow, okay? Yaz is off to do whatever his job is. Whatever. Now it's seven o'clock. I don't know. You what don't know you either? Mean? You taking him with you? Yeah. Oh, he's going to do some work. Bye bye. So proud of him. His first day on the job. He do. He does the hammer. Oh shit! I'm gonna leave. Okay, bye 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 bye. <laughs> My two little friends are here to assist me. Are you guys hungry? Is it time to eat? Yeah 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 yeah. Yes 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 yes. Yes baby. Yes baby. They had wet food this morning, so. I'm just gonna give them some dry food now. Yes, it's coming, it's coming. You excited? Are you excited? You come here, you come down. You come down, <laughs> Okay. He is so hungry all the time. He acts like we've never fed him. Yes, 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 baby. Here you go. Here you go, baby. Here you go, baby. There you go. Here you go, Lana. Look at these two little friends cuddling up to each other. Lila was grooming him up, but then they got distracted because I started moving. I'm so tired. I need to finish those jeans, but I'm too tired. Okay, that was a hassle. Either my machine just can't handle denim, or I need to get like a thicker needle. I'm thinking I'm gonna try it with a thicker needle because I love these, but I wanna add like a little bit of a frill up here. I don't know. I don't know, I just feel like doing that. Now I think I'm just gonna change into my pajamas. I'm like pretty dead. Yasu is working and he doesn't know when he's gonna finish. He works with his dad. And I think I already told you, but I think it's so funny that his dad told him like, oh, it's at seven and Yasu thought it was 7 a.m. So he went outside waiting for his dad at seven o'clock in the morning. But yeah, he said there's gonna be a few hours and he doesn't think that he's gonna be home for dinner. And I don't know what to do. What am I make for dinner? I don't, ugh, can't stand anymore. I don't feel like making something just for myself. I don't know what it is. I don't like cooking for myself. If I cook, I want someone else to eat my food. Something, should I get something from the convenience store? Or should I get McDonald's? Because, hear me out, McDonald's is doing this thing where they got really, really cute, like vintage style packaging because it's like their 50th anniversary or whatever. Oh, she's having a bit of a scratch. So I don't know, I have to think about that. I'm just gonna change the pajamas. But yeah, I mean, this turned out okay. It doesn't look amazing, but like, if you don't look close, it's fine, right? I'll be making it out of the video soon, so you'll get to see these 
a little more clearly. Here I am in my natural habitat. I think I'm just gonna Uber. <laughs> Honestly, I just don't feel like cooking for myself. And I want chicken nuggets, and I want the cute packaging, so this is happening. I was kind of like, oh, maybe I shouldn't just lay on the couch in my pajamas and eat McDonald's in front of the camera. But then I was like, yeah, but that's what I would be doing if there wasn't a camera. Like, this is what I, this is my ideal way to spend the evening alone. And I wanted this to be like a day in my life where I did stuff, which is exactly what it's been. And I just don't want to make dinner, so. I'm hungry now, actually. Oh my gosh, he wants to text the charger. No, you can't eat cables. So excited for the food to come. Okay, look, it's actually pretty cute. Oh, look at that, all vintage. Oh, I think the cat just turned the Xbox on. He wants to play a game. Oh, are you interested? Oh no. Oh dear. Okay, yeah, he's gonna have to go. <laughs> I love you, but you're gonna have to go. No, but wait. Look at the nuggets. Oh my gosh. Is this like how the packaging used to be or did they just make this up to make it look vintage? How cute is that? I don't know you guys, it's weird. I'm so tired these days. But like if that's it, there's no other... Like usually when I'm depressed, I'm like sad and tired, but I'm completely fine emotionally. Just tired? Not sure what that's all about. Like there's literally nothing else. I mean, I am busy, but like not that busy. In Japan, they only have barbecue and mustard sauce, which is like so weird. Like for the nuggets, because in the UK we have like sweet and sour, we have curry sauce. I didn't like nuggets as a kid, which is weird. I only started liking them as an adult. The fact that I ordered McDonald's just for the packaging. Like I'm such a slave to capitalism. Okay, I'm gonna play with the cat a bit because I feel like he hasn't had a lot of playtime today. Oh, there you go. And actually guys, I think this is where I'm gonna end the video. I know it's been such a boring day, nothing interesting has really happened, but I like to sometimes just take you guys along with me on my simple days. Oh no, he's gonna take my foot. Plus I feel like it's gonna be nice to look back on this when Teddy's big. And he's definitely gonna be fat because he eats so much this one. Because all I'm gonna do now is just, I'm gonna play with Teddy for until he's tired, which might take a while. Do the dishes, do some vacuum cleaning, maybe do some editing and then go to sleep. So not much interesting happening from this point on. But thank you guys ever so much for watching and for joining me on my little day at home. It's been very nice having you and it's thanks to you that I managed to get stuff done, I swear. Otherwise I would have just eaten the rest of that carrot cake and sat on the sofa. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Thank you, bye. Hey there, it's post video Mikan. Why are you still here? The video's over. Me? I'm eating carrot cake after playing with Teddy for half an hour. Somehow he still has the energy. How do you still have the energy to be here on this video? Leave me a comment. Let me know about your day. Tell me about your hobbies. Tell me your favorite cake. You should probably leave this video because this is all I'm gonna do. Just kind of sitting here. Eating cake. This cake's really good. You should really try to make it. The video is over. You don't have to be here anymore. You haven't left yet? Where haven't you left? The video is done. There's nothing interesting up to this point.